I am Gennaro Contaldo, and this is my family ragu. It's so good. Olive oil goes in. 500 gram top side of beef. You can use brisket as well, it's fantastic. Roughly this is the size you want. I have a 500 gram of spare ribs, 200 grams of sausages. Just cut them in half. A little salt, pepper. Mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it. Yeah, I can hear that beautiful noise. And it's the music I wanted. You get two bay leaves. Come on, I'm gonna put the tree inside. Don't just put the leaves, break it. Inside, seal the meat properly. I wanted them all like this. Yes. One, onions. Yes, I oh, got it. Don't worry if it's not too thick. The onions will dissolve it. Come have a look, get inside. Look at the color. Pork makes everything tasting good. Wine goes in. The wine you bring it is the one you use. Do not use a cooking wine. Come on, why is it cooking wine? Colored water? Nah, no way. It's almost dancing inside. Let the wine evaporate. So what that you do, you evaporate the alcohol. I want the onion to sweat, not to burn. Do you know what the difference between sweat and burn? Let me tell you. You need a bit of exercise, so you go jogging. <laughs> what do you do when you jog it? You sweat. That is a sweat. Okay, burn, you go to a holiday anywhere around the world, including Italy. You stand under the sun and for two hours or three hours, you burn. You don't want to do that. Three things of tomato, chopped. They kiss one each other and they go all in. Give them a little stir. Remember, it's still on a high flame. Good. Put about half a glass of wine, two tablespoons of a concentrated tomato. You dissolve it inside of a wine. Yeah. Now, fill it up with water. Two, three. Put them inside. Creating. Stir it. And it goes. Can you see the bubbling on the side? Yes. When you start to do that, you get a lovely bunch of basil. Blow the gas. Look, it's all bubbling. Fantastic. And let it cook slowly, slowly for about two hours. Memory back. I'm, I'm no joking. I remember my mama used to do this on a Sunday lunch. Come have a look inside it, come on. This is the perfect ragu, which goes well with perfect tagliatelle. If you want to see me how to make this tagliatelle, click the link now. Look at that, as soon as I put the past inside, it started dancing. Yes, the smell brings me memory back. I can't actually say anything. When you drizzle a bit of parmesan on top, it's like a bride and a groom throwing confetti on it. It's just fantastic. Drizzle of olive oil. Let's enjoy it. Mm. So delicious. Do you want some? Bellissimo! If you wanted to see more of my fantastic recipe from the Amalfi Coast, click on this link now! To see the latest recipe from Jamie Oliver's Food Tube channels, you must subscribe. It is very easy. Love you!